So since I discarded the first sheet on that roll, I am going to discard the first sheet on that roll just to control all of the variables. Now that one obviously ripped. That one's not going to be a good one. Okay, got that one. So you can see our dilemma here. We've got four different size sheets. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to put the sheets all on top of each other and line them up at the top. I'm starting with the largest one going down to the smallest one. And then I am simply going to cut these all the way across to the smallest one's size so that that takes out that variable. Let's start with the bounty basic. Now what I want to do is I want to hold it down into the, the tub of water just long enough to make sure that it's um, so thoroughly saturated. And then what I want to do is I'm going to, I'm going to hold the corners of the, the very tippy top corners of this and get my fingers underneath them. My plan is to hold it up and I am going to count 1001, 1002, 1003. The reason why I do that is because I want the water that is not absorbed into it to drop back into this container before I move it over into my other container where I'm going to squeeze the paper towel. So okay. Now I move it over to this one and now I'm going to squeeze this for all I'm worth. And again, I, if you're going to do this, you should have one person do the squeezing because that person might be a little stronger or a little weaker than the other person. So you want to make sure that they get every single drop out of it. And now, stick the funnel. I did not get very much out of this one. I may have to go to a smaller graduated cylinder. All right, it looks like, uh, ladies, it looks like we have got 11, 11 milliliters to try a one. It looks like it is ten. Okay, the members mark twenty milliliters. Uh, we're looking at eight milliliters for the mega bowl. 